The tools I used to build the spectrometer were a wood saw, a metal straight edge, a razor knife, a pair of scissors, and some tape. You'll need to get a poster tube. This is a three inch diameter poster tube. They come at about three foot lengths. You can cut them roughly in half. That'll give you a tube about 18 inches long or 0.45 meters long. You'll need the two end caps to shield out light from the tube. You'll need a compact disc. The ones we found to work best are the recordable kind that are blank. Any CD will work, but these work the best. Sometimes they have a bluish coating on them. You want the ones that look silvery bright. You'll need a piece of construction paper, which we're going to cut our slit in, and you'll need our cutting guide, which will be available online. To cut the slot for the compact disc, you'll take our cutting guide and wrap it around the end of the tube, get it lined up with the end and straight, then take a piece of tape and tape it down. To cut the slot, put it securely on a surface, bring in your saw, and cut slowly and carefully along the marked line. When you've cut all the way down, you're ready to insert the compact disc. To cut the eyepiece, you're going to use the razor knife, and you're going to cut all the way through that black square, and then poke out the cardboard. To make the slit, the first thing we're going to do is cut a wider slot in the end cap. So I'm going to use my metal straight edge to mark two lines. And then I'm going to use my razor knife to actually cut out the slot. Okay. The next thing is we're going to cut out a circular disc of black. First I'll trace it with my pen. That gets me the outside outline. Then I'll use the scissors, but I'll cut inside that line a little bit. And now I have my disc of paper that will slide nicely inside my end cap. So next, I'm going to make a line across a diameter of my black. There it is. And then I'm going to use my razor knife to cut a slit, nice straight slit down the middle, perhaps a millimeter wide. And there I have my nice slit. So we'll take our piece of paper, with the slit and we'll line it right up with the slot so the middle of the slits in the middle of the slot. I'll put a piece of tape off to the side to keep it from rotating so now it will maintain its alignment and then I will take it and put it into my tube. First I'm going to take my cutting guide off. You'll see I've cut my slot for the compact disc. I'm going to punch out the eye hole and now to put the whole thing together, I'll take my tube and I'll take the end cap without the slit and put it over the end with the eye hole in it to block light. I'll take my other end cap with the slit and I'll arrange the slit so that it's horizontal like the horizon while this hole is straight up. And then I can slide it in and I'll get the orientation correct. Next step, I'll put the compact disc into its slot you can see how that fits really nicely. And the mirror faces the slit. And here's my compact disc ready to go.